questions that a lot of people ask um, myself and the other therapists is about traveling and compression garments. So definitely if you have compression garments that you feel are working for you or that you've been properly fitted by one of us, we definitely encourage those when you travel. If um, you're watching this video and you don't have any compression garments and you have um, some swelling that happens sometimes just when you're at home or even when you travel, um, which is actually when a lot of people get um, extra swelling, uh, you definitely want to wear them when you travel. Um, I've had a lot of different patients that have approached me after they've traveled and they said, you know, gosh, you know, I went on my vacation and um, I got to my destination and my feet and legs were so swollen. I couldn't put on my shoes. I couldn't do all the activities I had planned. Um, so I definitely carry those stories to heart. Um, and I try to pass those on to others because if, if you're going away and you're excited about a trip and then you end up with swelling and you can't walk all the destinations you want to walk, you're kind of in a bad um, position. So always wear your compression garments when you travel. Um, if you don't consistently wear compression um, before you travel, um, I would recommend a few days beforehand. You kind of want to get your um, extremity, whether it be legs or for arm swelling, you want to make sure that you're in the best condition possible before you travel and you're um, subject to those different air pressures in the uh, airplane. Um, and if you're traveling by car, that's another situation we can talk about. But when you're traveling by plane, the different pressures do um, kind of mess with your swelling and they can make things worse. Um, so you want to kind of prepare for your flight, uh, wear the compression garments during the daytime, um, when you get to your destination, it's definitely understandable if you're somewhere and you just don't want to wear your compression garments. Um, if you're in a position that you um, aren't going to wear your garments, we would recommend you wearing them, you know, pre and post your um, your adventure out. Um, but the more you wear your compression garments, the better it, you're better. The better your situation is that you're not going to have problems um, during your trip. So definitely bring them. Um, if you're headed out somewhere, you can't wear them. Just wear them pre and post. Um, one thing that you might not know is if you're going somewhere where um, there's pool access, standing in a pool is mimicking basically the compression garments that would be on your legs. Um, so pool and pool therapy and any kind of activity in the water is amazing for swelling. So um, think of that and maybe that's kind of treating yourself to a day without your compression garments. Um, if you spend it in the pool, that will be just fine. Um, traveling by car, that's another one that um, gets people sometimes in a little bit of trouble, unfortunately. Um, they think, oh, I'm just traveling by car. It's just a few hours. It won't make much of a difference. But when you're when you're kind of sitting in a position like I'm sitting in, you're kind of like I like to call it crimped off at your lymphatics, and it can definitely cause a like a like a back back loading of the fluid in your legs and in your feet. So you definitely want to get out of the car every couple hours, uh, maybe every two hours would be ideal. Um, or if you have access in your car to kind of stretch out and kind of make yourself long, um, you probably can't elevate your legs in the car, but you could try. <laughs> um, but anyway, any type of movement you can do so that you're not consistently sitting in like a bent position would be ideal. Um, if you've watched other, our other videos on um, different deep breathing and different exercises you can do from a chair, those would be wonderful to do in the car or even in the plane if you can. Um, but yeah, you definitely want to be careful when you're traveling to wear your garments and do everything that your, lymph your lymphedema therapist has told you in order to have the best results on your vacation. Mm -hmm.